to Psychonauts. When we left off, I was... I was introduced to this uh, wonderful summer camp, and via a terrifying romp through the brain of Coach Oleander, and uh, now we're going to continue on our journey to the, 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 the to receive special training from Sasha Nine. As long as the recording is working properly. Hold on. Let me check. Make sure it didn't freeze up in the first 10 seconds, as it sometimes tends to do. No, we good. Okay. Okay. Some advanced training right now, as a matter of fact. So well, new kid is really a name I'm doing some advanced training, so I don't know if new kid is really the night right. Anybody? What the heck? There was some lag on that dialogue. Advanced training that he does in a secret underground lab, are you? Like, look at that. Their mouths are still moving after the dialogue ends. When no one can hear you screaming. Why? Yes, I am. Shakes a lot. Well. Nice knowing you. Jeez. What the heck is this advanced training? Also, like, that was the most smug response. He's like, I'm doing some advanced training, so don't call me new kid. It's already getting, getting an ego. Hey, was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. <laughs> in the woods. Get owned. Mm, She's no. thinking about the first time we met else. when she you was clearly like staring at me. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. What? Watching. I know when? A when was there a shadowy being? Description. Likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. God, these you. facial models are Who? ugly. <laughs> Why doesn't she have a nose? <laughs> she just has no nose. Wait, am I going the right way? Hopefully. Entering Boathouse and Beach. What? Did I take a wrong turn? I thought I was going the right way. Now we're on another loading screen. Great. Exactly what I wanted. What? Where is this? Hold on. Let me look at the map. Oh, I'm in a different area now? What the frick? How did I end up over here? Did I, like, go through a cave down there or something? What's this place? Well, let's go see what this is. <laughs> that fish. What the hell? Is that the toilet hand from Zelda? <gasps> Me too. Huh? No. Well, yes. I just you know, my family has this problem with water. What? It's a bunch of hooey anyway. Some old gypsy curse about how we're all supposed to die in water. What? If you can believe that. That's oh, random. I thought it was That's random. With the brain eating fish that walks out of the lake at night to hunt for victims. Well, that too then. If that's real. Um, hey Raz, I saw you and Lily talking in the coach's class, and I was wondering, were you asking her to go with you? Who's Lily? What? No, 
I'm here to train. No distractions. No distractions. This Bye. guy Raz is kind of pretentious. Paul, well, six seagulls, dude. Okay, this place is creepy. I'm gonna grab this thing and I'm gonna get out of here. Yep. Entering GPC and wilderness. I still feel the compulsive need to check OBS every few seconds and make sure it's didn't freeze up proper, didn't freeze up and stop recording the visuals, because it does that sometimes. Okay, so is this the way to the secret lab? Wait, what? This is another area. Oh my god. Sure do love loading screens. What is this? There needs to be a dedicated map button. Okay, well now I'm in the wrong area again, so that's great. Oh, okay. Just this way. Weird. This place is sketchy. What the frick is that? Where are you? What's this kid's deal? I, these fences, like, just glitch in and out. And then the signs on them glitch, too. Okay, hold, hold on. Where are you, kid? Don't know where you are. Shut up. What is this place? Oh my god, shut up. What is this area? Hello? Is anybody here? Other than the crying kid? Where's the door? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, there's a camera center button. Please just kill me now. Uh... Alright, I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but this kid is starting to get on my nerves. Let me in! Oh my god. What is that thing? Okay. I'm gonna punch all of these things. They're the only things that are actually letting me attack them. <laughs> oh my god. What? Where is he? What am I supposed to be doing? I don't want to hear this stupid kid crying. 
He sounds like he's inside of this dome at the top, but... Uh, what? Why did that? Oh my god. Cool. What is this thing? So I had to punch a very specific a part of that. Uh, geodesic psycho isolation chamber. Oh man, cool. I thought this was where I was supposed cool. to be meeting up with Sasha and I. Any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, Something cool. No, it's a six sensory deprivation tank. A hermetically sealed metaphysical hot box. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Oh. Boolean warfare complex should assault own size or larger only. What? While in cooler. Oh God, the Russian guy sounds so weird. Where hair should be? No. What? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Dude, the Russian guy is weird. Hey, wait. Okay, so where's Sasha and I? I thought this is where I was supposed to meet him. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, call me crazy, but I have just got to sell more side course today. So, yes, these prices are real. Hmm. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. What am I... How do I pick it up? What are the controls? Of course there's no map button. Whatever. Like, why is there a power menu button and a... Like, why is there an inventory menu and a power menu button, but no, uh... Map button. That's bizarre. Alright, back to the game. Call me crazy, but I have a weird feeling that that button Sasha gave me goes here. What button? What? What? To pull out an item from your backpack, point to it, okay? Button that Sasha gave me. Oh my god. Clue to the location of his seat. Doesn't help that the camera angle here is awful. It keeps like angling back down. This is the button that Sasha gave Oh my god. It's a clue to the location of his secret lab. What? How do I use the button? Okay, I just had to be standing in the right spot. Alright. I couldn't just be standing anywhere on that square. I had to be standing in a very specific spot. What? Is this where the hairless bear is? Uh, have you seen a bear with lo with no hair, skin where hair should be? Agent Nine, I'm here for the advanced training. The heck is this place? Can I just jump down? So what are we gonna learn? There we go. Bending spoons, burning stuff. I've been hearing a lot about head explosion, and I was wondering... Science, Rasputin. That is what we practice down here, not parlor tricks. If you are serious about exploring the possibilities of your mind, step up to the brain tumbler. The brain tumbler. Brain tumbler? Step up to the brain tumbler and have your brain tumbled. So, what's this hairdryer thing do? Ah, you're ready for the brain tumbler. With this device, we will send you deep into your own psyche, where you should find unparalleled insight and power. Excellent! Tumble away! I will tumble it up in! This will not hurt, unless something really very bad happens. Hello. Wow! Is this what the inside of my mind looks like? This is a tiny corner of what we call the collective unconscious, a place in which all of our unconscious minds are connected. 
You have just begun your training, Rasputin, so many of the connections with other minds are still not developed for you, and those doorways remain just out of reach. Oh. But the more you explore the mental world, the more connections you will form. Right now, the only unconscious world you can enter is that one. Your own. What Stop about you? Coach Oleander, dude? Alright. What happens if I fall off? I cannot fall off. Brain Tumbler Experiment. Sasha? Where am I? You are inside your own mind, but I'm not sure where. Tell me, what can you see? I see a rundown gypsy caravan. Do you recognize it? Yes. It's where I was born. I see. <laughs> Compelling. Doesn't seem like he's real fond of his family, does he? Sasha, I'm going inside the caravan. Uh-oh. What? No, I'll figure it out. I'm trapped in a white room. I'm trapped in a loading screen. Rasputin, tell me what is happening. Aha! I broke the loading screen. Rasputin, are you okay? What do you see now? Uh... I see small Bunny like animal thing. God, it's horrifying. An unfamiliar animal entity in a dream often represents a primal fear or memory. Follow it, and it should lead you somewhere important. Check. Okay, Mr. Bun. You and I are gonna be tight. Mr. Where Bun. You go, I go. I prefer to call you Two Freak of Nature. Hey! Come back here! God, that thing's ugly. It has the same, like, bizarro broken head shape as all the characters in this game. Oh god, what is that? I don't like that. I feel like I'm about to go down the, uh, the rabbit hole. Let's go to Wonderland, dude. Sasha? What is it? Another bunny? No. This is more of a super scary flaming eyed demon. Uh, hi. Oh. Hmm. What? Okay, I'm pulling you out of there. Just give me a second. Uh, Sasha? Hold on, I'm still getting some unusual interference. It's fascinating. As if someone else. Were... Agent 9? Sorry. Almost ready. Sasha! Hmm. That should not have happened. We need to try that again. Oh, I don't think I need to be in the tumbler with the glowy eye guys anymore. Suit yourself. You know, in many tribal societies, learning to defeat the monsters you see in your dreams is considered a rite of passage. I can train you to fight. Come see me when you're ready. Defeat that big monster I saw. That's my new quest. Stick. Train me to fight. I need combat lessons. Okay. I'm ready to learn how to really fight. Oh, really? Hmm. What? Um, uh, nothing. It's just that I didn't think you'd really take me up on that offer. It usually scares the kids off. <laughs> Not me. I'm ready to kill for my camp. Ah. Uh... I'm sorry, but I can't train you. Agent Vodello would kill me. Wow, you why? What she doesn't know won't hurt her. You don't even have a marksmanship learner's permit. I could lose my job. I'll get one. Even if you use that secret passage over there and snuck into his sanctuary, Agent Crawler would never give you a marksmanship learner's perk. Agent Crawler. Who's that? A million. I'm off. Be right back after I talk with Agent Crawler. <laughs> He's de this kid's determined, dude. Welcome Oof. to the Whispering Rocket Underground Rapid Transit System. 
Would you like to go back to your private sanctuary now, Agent Krella? Is this ASMR? Does this count as... Take me to the kids' cabins area. Wait, what? No, that's not what I wanted. Oh, jeez. I was mashing the space button, dude. Well, it looks like we're going back in. Where would you like me to? Where? Which one is the place where he is? I don't. What? It's time to go to the lake. Yes, sir, Admiral. What? I don't get it. None of those places are where they told me to go. So... I'm a little confused. Great, where's Ford Cruer? Oh, Ford! That guy. That's what that text meant. Go to Ford's sanctuary. Uh, I mean my sanctuary. I was like, what does that mean? Would you like me to take Let's go to Ford's, I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, <laughs> noble psychomaster. Oh, it thinks, it thinks he's Agent Ford. I understand. Agent Kruler. Ford Kruler. The lunch man who sells the PSI badges. Bum, bum. Bomb psychic room, psychic room, where, where Ford Krula lives. Hmm, you finally made it. It's an honor to finally meet you in person, sir. Didn't we see him earlier in the store? I couldn't be sure. Now that I see you in your element, there's no doubt. You're Ford Kruller, the greatest leader the Psychonauts ever had. Well, you shouldn't believe everything you read in True Psychic Tales magazine. Sasha says I need to learn how to fight better. You wants to teach you advanced combat on your first day? Yeah. I had a vision with a huge monster with yellow eyes and a big mouthful of gnashing teeth. Did it happen to spit anything at you? Yeah. I think it was like an old diving helmet or something. I see. Hmm. Yes, well, we'd better get you armed. Why? What's happening? Nothing, nothing. Uh, okay. That's the motto of the Psychonauts. Here, this is a marksmanship learner's permit. It will only work when you're in Sash's mind. Once you complete his shooting range, you'll get the real merit badge and you can side blast anywhere you want. PSI? Side blast? Oh, you'll find out. Now get going. We can't have the camp overrun. PSI blast, dude. Monsters, can we? No, sir. PK fire. So, so what? What mission are you on down here? Well, from here I can monitor world events, look for signs of psychic terrorism, ripples in the astral plane. But why is he doing it from the summer camp? Right. You've got a jet hidden here somewhere, I'll bet. Well, you know, these days I'm really just more of a, a dispatcher. I spot the trouble and send out a, a, a younger agent, that like Mia or Sasha. Or maybe you someday. What are you doing here at Whispering Rock? This training facility is built right smack on top of the largest titanium deposit. Titanium, oh my god. It runs under this whole valley and makes this a very critical area for the psychonauts. So I'm here to look after it and to make sure you little spoon benders don't kill each other. What's titanium? Titanium is a very rare psychoreactive mineral that crashed here on a meteorite hundreds of years ago. It responds to psychic waves, focuses them, amplifies them. It can make psychics more psychic, but it can also make unstable people more unstable. Not everyone can handle that much activity in that part of their brain. It can drive them completely out of their gorge. Gives this valley an interesting history. The, uh... 
drive him out of a gourd is fitting when all of the characters' heads are as ugly as a gourd, dude. Thanks. I'll need it. Don't worry. I'll be right. My head? If you ever want to make me appear, you can do it with this special device. Is that a piece of bacon? Oh, yeah. I just what? love bacon. I smell that stuff and I can't help it. I drop everything and come running. Okay. So I just need to carry around a piece of bacon the size of my head. You get a move on or I'll eat that right here. Oh my god. I probably don't want to be down here. So now I have bacon and smelling salt. Weird. Now, before you go electrocuting yourself, let me tell you how these babies work. Now, this what? beauty here is a mental cobweb detangler. Oh. oh. I know what those are. Mental oh, okay. cobwebs are. You see, I was just trying to head back up to the top. Collected for too long, mental cobwebs form. You can take a projection of it into the mental world with you and use it to extract any cobwebs you find. I am the skipping of some of the dialogue. The on the real world side. So you can hook it up to the loom and weave that tangled mess into something useful like a card from a side challenge marker, which brings us to this fella over here. You put nine side cards into this guy, along with one side core, and it will kick out a bona fide side challenge marker, which will earn you a promotion to a higher rank. Rank up enough, you'll earn new psychic abilities. This is too much information. Why did I come down here? Put my mental cobwebs in there, and my side cards and cores in there, and soon I'll be able to burn stuff. Yep, basically. Have fun. Okay. Burn stuff. You mean like... PK FIRE! PK STARSTORM! PK FIRE! PK FIRE! PK FIRE! PK STARSTORM! Everyone's favorite... Sans... Fighter... Uh, I don't know what I'm Where saying. Would you like me to Take me to the... Kids... Cabin. No, no, no. Geodesic. Roger that. Roger that, Ranger Kruda. I saw Nils peeking into a hole in the girl's cabin. I'm hiding. And I thought, oh, Nils. When will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourself staring back. What? Uh -huh. What? I... I really hey, don't Louis. care. Going for the advanced training? What's the rush? Are you kidding? I only have a few days to become a psychonaut or I lose my shot forever. Look, Raz. I hate to burst your bubble. But the psychonauts are not what they used to be. Times have changed. The world just doesn't need us anymore. The world does too need psychonauts. Right here at this very camp, in fact. I think there are several fishy things that need psychic investigating. You are so immature. And cute. When are you gonna just shut up and kiss me? Shut up and do what? Oh, I didn't know you could. Uh, I gotta go. Bye, so embarrassing. What? Okay, so I can... Please stop talking. I'm tr I'm trying to do something here. So, what, okay. Wait. How does this even make sense? Because this is up on a platform. There's no pole below it. So how am I falling into his lair? I don't know. Mind shenanigans, dude. Also, apparently, I can read minds now. Got these big staircase. Okay. Okay, I got it. Check it out. Well, my <laughs> are you sure you are ready to do this? It could be dangerous. Yes. 
Are you gonna pull me into your mind like the coach did? Hmm. No offense, but it's time you saw what an organized mind looks like. <laughs> Enter the mind. Welcome to my mind, boy. You will find things you have never seen before. What the heck? Welcome to my mind. Huh. It's so empty. Uh, I mean... There's more here than meets the eye, but I've learned to keep it under strict control, and that's what I'm going to teach you. Control your feelings, your fears, your anger. You must learn to control them, focus them, concentrate them, and release them. As therapy? No, as firepower. Ooh. Say something hideous and horrible jumps out at you. Something so disgusting that it simply must die. <laughs> oh, it's so tacky. I can't look directly at it, but I control those feelings, focus them, concentrate, and release. And the world is a better place. Your turn. I can shoot lasers from my mind? Let's do this. I like that I'm just shooting a bunch of tacky lamps. Well done, Raz. Okay, Keep so that's... Well done, Raz. Keep shooting. Wow, Excellent. sick. A victory for good taste. Now you must strive for precision when targeting. Say you were set upon by multiple attackers. But you need to dispense with them in a certain order. Eliminate these monsters in the proper sequence, bum, bum, and we can move bum, on to the next bum, lesson. Bum, bum, tutorial. Oh shit. Good shooting, Raz. But you you need it makes Let's try again. I this need to aim. Lock your mental focus. I thought I could just aim the camera, but I got to aim Raz. Good shooting, Raz. But you are making it harder Wait, what? than it needs to be. You need to practice locking your mental focus. What? It makes targeting and evasive maneuvers much easier. Let's what? try again. This time, oh. lock your mental focus. So it's like I lock on. What? Shooting, Raz. I don't understand. Let's try again. This time, lock your mental focus. What does that mean? What? Yes, yes, we all know you can punch things, but you're supposed to be learning how to use your side. Try it without punch. What? Good shooting, Raz. But you're I don't understand. What do you want? Again. This time, lock your mental focus. Maybe I'm like hitting the other ones. Good shooting, Raz. You need to I don't hit. understand. What am I supposed to be doing right now? Lock your mental focus. Let me look at the controls. Is there like a lock on button or something? Lock on. Float. Mm-mm. Yes. Wait, oh. Yes, yes. Oh, and then I... And, okay, and then I shoot. I see. Good. Again. Good. Again. There we go. Now then. What is happening? Is this what you saw in your vision? Uh, uh well, no. Sure definitely not. Bigger in my head. Ah. Problems often seem larger in our heads than they really are. That's an important. <laughs> what lesson. is that thing? This is a sensor, an integral part of any sane person's mind. The sensors roam through your psyche, looking for thoughts that don't belong, hallucinations, manias, waking dreams. The sensors hunt them down and censor them out. Why do they come after me? I'm not a mania. Yes, but you are a foreign entity in my mind. You technically don't belong here. Yes, but I was attacked in my own head. <laughs> yes, well, the brain tumbler could be malfunctioning, or you could be insane. We'll uh... ask for that later. For now, <laughs> blast it. Ah, 
That's the spirit. I killed it. It was just a thought I was having, and it's not dead. It has just returned to its basic form, raw psychic energy. Go absorb it. It's good for your mental health. Okay, I gotta listen to all the dialogue. How do I get up there? Okay. As you absorb this energy, your mental health increases. But as you side blast, you expend your will to do damage. What? So be on the lookout for these small, dense clusters of raw psychic aggression. Absorb these as well to make sure you always have enough firepower. Now I'll leave the machine on for you so you can practice. You have to blast 1,000 sensors to earn your mark. 1,000? That's a lot. Every day for practice, and you should have enough in as little as three weeks. Three weeks? I only have a few days to earn all my merit badges and become a psychonaut. Slow and steady wins the race, my eager young friend. Now practice, slowly and carefully. Oh, man. What's, uh, save? In the next episode, we can... In the next episode, we can do this stuff. Arrivederci!